how to enable administrator account in Windows 10. In most of the cases, administrator account is not required to be active at all. It is often used for troubleshooting or administrative purpose when it is enabled. When you install Windows 10 on your PC or run it for the first time, it comes pre-installed with the computer. You create the first user account during the process, which will be the main account on the system and configured to be an administrator account by default. But it is not the only one that is created during the process. Windows 10 creates two additional user accounts automatically, which are both inactive by default. The first is a guest account, which Microsoft designed for the user who access the device but don't have the permanent account on it. Guest accounts are severely limited as it is not possible to install software or hardware or modify system settings. The second is administrator account. It is also inactive by default and needs to be enabled before it can be used. A difference between administrator account of the user and this built-in administrator account is the user account is an elevated administrator account while the built-in administrator account is an elevated account. To enable the Windows 10 administrator account, right-click on Windows key. This will open the options. Select the command prompt admin and this will bring to the command prompt screen. Another way to open the command prompt is open search bar Cortana and type in CMD. This will find the command prompt option, right click and select run as an administrator. Type net user to display a list of all user accounts on the system. To activate the inactive administrator account, type net user space administrator space forward slash active colon yes. The administrator account is active now which means that you can sign in to the system using it. It is not password protected by default, which means that anyone with the access to the system can use it. It is recommended to protect it with password. To add a password through the command prompt, type in net space user space administrator space asterisk. That is a star looking symbol. Also, you can find it by pressing shift 8 and hit enter. You get a password prompt, type a desired password, then enter, then retype a password and enter. Now your administrator account is password protected. Ok, to disable account at any time, use the following command, nate space user space administrator space forward slash active colon no no. Furthermore, now where you can see these changes in Windows 10. If I go to the start menu, there is only one account, but as soon as I activate administrator account, it will show up here and you can now easily select and run this account. I hope you enjoy watching this video. Subscribe this channel to get more free DIY tech fix videos in future. Don't hesitate to contact me if you have any questions or suggestions. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.